What is up? This is Tom Froming from TwinsDaily.com, and we should all probably be talking about Nelson Cruz more than we do. That that goes for Twins fans, that goes for Minnesotans, that goes for, I don't know, any population you can think of should probably be talking more about Nelson Cruz. This guy has been remarkable, and a lot of the focus is on his age, and yes, that is definitely a very a unique aspect to this, but let's just focus on the numbers here. Uh, I noticed that after that double header, he has now played in 162 games for the Minnesota Twins. Obviously, that represents a full regular season. Now, nobody really plays the full 162 hardly anymore, but it's a really fun reference point for us to have uh, in comparison. And look at this as a twin 111 runs scored, 56 home runs. 139 RBI, 318 batting average, 402 on base percentage, and a 650 slugging percentage for an OPS of 1.052. Again, that is in his career thus far as a twin. Wow. Uh, Who saw this coming? I mean, you can see up here, this was the four seasons he spent with Seattle. I mean, that's incredible. These are great numbers, and he's blowing them out of the water, and he just keeps getting better. He really established himself in Texas. You see the numbers there. Spent one year in Baltimore and was even better, and then was even better than that in his years with the Mariners, and now is just putting the cherry on top here with the Twins. Let's take a look at where he ranks among the league leaders since the start of last season, since he became a Twin. All right, so here we are over at Fangraphs. I've got the leaders since the start of the 2019 season, you know, the boomstick, we got to start with home runs. He is fifth in home runs with those 56 tied uh, with Jorge Soler. And the thing that really sticks out, however, is that all these other guys have at least 700 plate appearances. Uh, some of them are even 800. And here's a fun fact for Twins fans. Let's see who the next guy is on this list who doesn't have 700 plate appearances. Okay, keep scrolling down just a little bit here, and we get to, oh, there's one, 594. Oh, it's Miguel Sano. 44 home runs and 594 plate appearances for him the last two years. But, again, we're focusing in on Nelson Cruz here, moving on. His RBI total, where does that rank over the last two seasons? He is ninth with 139 RBI. Keep it moving here. Batting average. Not that many guys hit 300 these days. You know, batting average isn't the uh, isn't the hot stat anymore for good reason. Uh, but Nelson Cruz, sixth in batting average. And you can see I have this to where it's pulling only people with 400-plus plate appearances. Uh, so Luis Arise popping in there at uh, 323. Very nice. How about on-base percentage? Nelson Cruz gets on base a lot. He is sixth in on-base percentage at 402. Not that many guys with a 400-plus OBP. Slugging, obviously what Nelson Cruz is most known for. Only Mike Trout, and it's only by a point, has a better slugging percentage than Nelson Cruz since he became a twin. That is wild. He's also second to only Trout in WOBA and WRC+, Plus, if you prefer those advanced metrics. And they're pretty darn close between those two. Obviously, Trout brings a lot to the table as a defensive center fielder uh, and also runs the bases a little better. But from a purely offensive hitting standpoint, that's the only guy in the league who's been better than Nelson Cruz over the past two seasons so far. So what a signing this has been for the Minnesota Twins getting Nelson Cruz again has just been a beast over his first 162 games in the organization uh, they signed him to a one-year contract with an option for this year. That was a no-brainer, but that's it at this point. He signed through 2020. Uh, he's next going to be a free agent in 2021, so he's set to become a free agent this offseason. I uh, don't want to spin this uh, ang- <laughs> a negative way real quick, uh, but... You know, the universal DH is in 2020. We don't know for certain that that's going to be the case in 2021 or not. But all of a sudden, if 15 more teams have the DH, Nelson Cruz is going to have quite the market this offseason. And, you know, you'd think things have gone really well here with the Twins. Uh, He seems very comfortable. Uh, The team is a World Series contending type team. 
But if there's somebody he's always dreamt of playing for or a coach he would want to reunite with or another former player he'd want to reunite with, I don't know. Maybe there's a dream scenario out there for Nelson Cruz that's attainable this offseason in free agency. You know, if a team like the Dodgers, you know, that team is absolutely stacked. If they come knocking at your door when you're a free agent, I mean, I'd imagine you'd jump at the chance to go there uh, right now. Uh, again, I, I think Minnesota's worked out really well for Nelson Cruz, and I'd hope he'd want to stick around and that the Twins would do everything in their power possibly to keep him uh, because that was we've shown through these numbers. He has been remarkable. Uh, and again, the age thing, it always comes back to that. You know, I didn't want to start there, but we got to we got to get there. Uh, it can't completely ignore it. The end is going to come eventually. Nobody plays forever. Um, but. You know, I would think even another one-year contract with an option with some guaranteed money in the second year. I mean, hell, even a guaranteed two-year deal for Nelson Cruz, even if you're expecting that second year to go uh, pear-shaped and that you're probably going to be burning money in that second year. I mean, the guy's been <laughs> worth uh, a lot. So it's going to be really interesting to see. And there's always a chance maybe he retires. You know, Nelson Cruz is a guy who has a lot more going on in his life than baseball. Uh, he's been recognized for his humanitarian efforts. Uh, so there's bigger stuff that he's got going on that he, he could impact uh, certainly where he's from in the Dominican as well. So you never know what, uh, what a guy's motivations are going to be, but wow, what a run he's had so far with the twins. And I'm just hoping this lasts as long as possible. Cause this has been amazing. <laughs> Thanks for checking this out. Again, this is Tom. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button. Leave a comment down below. Maybe let me know your favorite Nelson Cruz moments as a twin. And if you want more twins content here on YouTube, please consider subscribing.